Cloud Hub building the building mule applications to support persistent queues. Uh, here we are considering uh, building mule app applications to support persistent queues. Uh, uh, in uh, Cloud Hub, for your application to benefit from the persistent queuing, implement the reliability patterns in your application code, separating individual XA transactions. Uh, the reliable acquisition flow reliably delivers uh, uh, a message from an inbound HTTP connector. Uh, to an outbound uh, uh, VM endpoint. If the reliable acquisition flow cannot put the message into the VM queue, uh, it ensures that the message is not lost by returning the uh, uh, unsuccessful response to the client uh, so that uh, the client can rely the retry the request. Uh, application logic uh, flow delivers the message uh, from the uh, inbound uh, VM endpoint to the business logic processing uh, in your application. This flow represents uh, one transaction. Uh, your business logic may involve several other transactions uh, not sh shown. Between these two flows, uh, VM queues hold the messages committed by the reliable acquisition. Uh, for flow until they are ready for processing by the application logic flow. Uh, in case of processing error within a transaction or in the case of transaction timeout that the allotted, uh, allotted uh, for the transaction is exceeded, Mule triggers the rollback. Uh, this rollback erases any partial uh, processing that has occurred in the message and passes the message back to the queue. Uh, uh, if your mule instance experiences an outage and is unable to execute rollback the transaction, transaction automatically roll back uh, once the time uh, time allotted for the transaction is exceeded. Allotted time is determined by the timeout attribute of the transaction element. You can configure timeout uh, yourself or accept the default. It is uh, helpful to think that each transaction in terms of three steps. Uh, begin, uh, Mule kicks off the processing of all subcomponents within the transaction. Uh, uh, commit. Mule send the result to the completed transaction to the next step. For XA transaction, uh, uh, commit step has two phases, commit request phase and commit uh, phase. During the commit phase, Mule coordinates the result the Mule, of the Mule resources within the scope that the transaction and confirm that all processing exceeded executed successfully and ready to commit. Commit phase then calls the each resource to the commit uh, its processing. Uh, rollback, uh, if the error, if an error occurs in either the begin or commit step, roll back back to the options within the transaction so that no one part results in the partial completion. Here you can see a request a client is connected to the HTTP via request HTTP and at message queue are in uh, reliable acquisition flow. Uh, HTTP is connected to the add message uh, queue and here the HTTP is connected to uh, the client uh, status response and uh, here the add messages add message queue is add messages add message to the queue is connected to the VM uh, VM interacts with the reliable uh, acquisition flow and application logic flow VM is connected to the consume message from the queue uh, consume message from the queue uh, flow ref to the business logic subflow and add message to the queue uh, are in uh, application logic flow transaction one here Consume message to from queue is connected to flow ref to a business logic subflow and and it is connected to uh, add message to queue and it's connected to the VM.
now uh, this is the uh, end of my presentation thank you very much for watching it